And it is one of those days that you're going to want to hit up the beach. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, hopefully the water's clean enough and all that, um, because, man, it is feeling yeah, like... Hot. The upper you know, it may even be a little bit too warm for the beach out yeah. there. It's getting pretty hot here, but the warmer temperatures certainly are feel like temperatures even warmer than what the actual highs are. So we're seeing a lot of those highs uh, sitting anywhere between the upper 80s to lower 80s. But take a look at what these feel like temps are like. Let's start up in Broward County. Feels like 99 degrees we're real close to triple digit feel like temperatures here in Coral Springs. The same in Deerfield Beach. You're seeing 98 across the board here from uh, Margate over to Sunrise and into plantation as well. 96 Miramar again. These are feel like temperatures. Take a look here in Miami Dade. Coral Springs feels like 97 degrees and it feels like 95 stretching from Aventura down to Key Biscayne here. And as we take a broader look as well down into the Keys, Marathon feeling like 97 degrees here. So certainly a warm day, a hot day at that. And we're still dealing with some hazy conditions here as we take a live look outside our downtown Miami camera there. Uh, so 89 degrees right now in Miami. As I mentioned, some areas in South Florida, either 89 or the lower 90s at this point. And take a look, Miami feeling like 98 degrees there. And we've still got some humidity hanging around as well. Now we have been tracking just a few showers that have popped up over the warm uh, waters of the Atlantic. They continue to track to the west, but pretty much dissipating before they get a chance to get onto land. So let's talk about what you could expect in terms of any rainfall really it's likely going to be an inland event for the afternoon, maybe around one or two o'clock, but really far inland. This would be west of Chrome Avenue, um, so very inland parts of Miami Dade and Broward. They'll continue pushing off to the west there. That's where a majority of the activity will be and will stay clear through the rest of the evening. So for the future temperatures into the afternoon, I showed you the feel like temperatures. The actual temps likely will be in the 90s for a majority of inland parts of Broward and Miami Dade, but along the coast, it could be in the 80s for an actual temperature. So just a little bit cooler here, but again, those feel like temperatures are much warmer than that here. So keep that in mind and really not a relief from the heat here. We're going to have warm temperatures really through the rest of the evening and into those overnight hours. We're also keeping a track of the tropics here. We've been talking about this. It has a medium chance of development here, continuing to track to the northwest, not really expecting to have any impacts for us here in Florida, but it's something we will continue to monitor. So uh, recapping real quick, we'll have a high of about 91 degrees here for that actual high, but those temps will feel even a little bit warmer. If you're hoping for some real relief, likely by Sunday on Father's Day, that's when we could have our next chance for some moisture increasing as a cold front uh, moves our way and we'll keep those 90s in play for the weekend as well.